I'm curious. I want to know, what do you guys take when you go on your trips? guys welcome to another episode of Bubba's Garage I got some exciting news to tell you about today check this out guys my office is clean so you know we're doing all the preparations for the trip getting ready for that overland trip that I've been telling you guys about just about in every vlog in doing that it kind of forced me to clean up my office a little bit so I'm really stoked I'm really excited that I was able to get some stuff done I'm working on getting stuff together for the trip and I was looking at all the camera mounts and GoPro accessories. I'm curious, I want to know, what do you guys take when you go on your trip? What equipment, extra equipment, do you need uh, for your cameras, the charging station? Charging all of this equipment takes so many different plugs, right? I mean. I was looking at that, I got a handy dandy extension cord for the purpose, but it's got way too many USB devices, you know, to, that just need to be charged um, to be able to record all the time, you know? So check this out, I'm gonna show you guys what I have. You gotta tell me what you guys take along with you. So here's what I got. So we uh, we have a, you know, one of these cheap cheap selfie sticks that we take, right? You know, it's always handy to have around. Uh, we got one of these, I also have another one of these just like this, so for much, much more heavier duty for the GoPro. You got some zip ties because sometimes you need to tie these mounts up. Extra adhesion strips, more brackets just in case. Things I got some extra AAA batteries in case I need them. And of course, my handy dandy suction cup. And you know, with an overland trip, you just never know where you're gonna end up mounting a GoPro. I mean, uh, we, we've done things from underneath the vehicle to the sides of the vehicle to on the roof and you just never know and obviously you gotta have all your documentation because you just never know some of the trips that we take there's there's no data signal you just you don't have access to the internet so you gotta take some printed maps outside of that the, the only other thing that we have is a bunch of a bunch of memory cards so what do you guys take what do you take on your trips because I'm, I have so much equipment that I'm always afraid that I'm going to take too much or take too little. So I have to filter through all this stuff just to try to figure out what it is that I need to take or not need to take. It's, it's Sometimes it's challenging. Like I said, I just want to take it all. Anyway, so today, again, just like yesterday, it's a lot of little preparations for the trip. Seven days. Making sure that the first aid kit is fully stocked. Making sure that the tools fully stocked. We have the right tools to do the job. If we do, I'm not going to have the tools to take care of that. But I don't think it's going to be that extreme, but we'll see. You just never know. We definitely are taking extra fuel in the back uh, on the cargo carrier. We're carrying extra fuel. We got an extra six gallons of fuel back there. Um, then it's a matter of clothing, which is really weird because 
it's Texas right now, and, and typically you would expect it to be somewhat cold. It's actually really nice out. I mean, it, Christmas Day is going to be like the 70s. I mean, it's really nice out. I mean, the temperature is like here in the low 70s right now. I mean, talking about the next day or two, it's going to be in the 80s. So I don't know what to pack on this trip. I might have to pack summer gear and winter gear. I don't know. So Bobby and Shelby are out. Um, Shelby's getting her shots today. Remember, she's getting her rabies shot and her portatella today. So we'll see how that goes. Um, last I heard, she was kind of a little afraid. She was a little scared, but hopefully it's not too bad. And we did find out that it is selective hearing. We just left our well checkup and found out that Shelby is actually, in fact, normal. Hard to believe. And we got how many shots, babe? Two. Two shots today. She was all kinds of worked up about it. She sat there and took them like a champ, man. I'll tell you what, she did wonderful. I'm very proud of her. Thanks, Mom. You're welcome. I told you it's not gonna be that bad. It's only as bad as you make it out to be, right? Right. Right? They should be back shortly. So, meanwhile, I'm gonna go figure out what snacks I wanna take on the trip because we're gonna be on the road so much and in areas where there's no civilization for 150, 250 miles. So we gotta bring some snacks. 